I said earlier, for those regular, those regular viewers of our league of football, know exactly that and know this type of performance isn't a surprise from Celta Vigo. Mayo with a cross. Falls to Nolito, expecting it from the fans when he gets it, because he can do magical things like that. The former Barcelona youngster shows them exactly what they missed. Just as, I, as I was saying, you know, as regular viewers watching a Celta Vigo performance like this isn't a surprise. And watching a goal like that from Nolito certainly isn't a surprise. He's been in great form for the last 18 months, and he's been doing this on a regular basis. Former Barcelona player, B player, under Luis Enrique. He's in the form of his life, must be pushing to an international spot, possibly return back to Barcelona. But it's a brilliant finish, inch perfect, just out of the reach of Ter Stegen. The accuracy just in off the far post. Perhaps Barcelona could do more to put him under pressure. They know he's the danger man. They don't do that, they give him the time, and they are punished. It was a wonderful goal from a player. Alito is one of those that got away from Barcelona. He played five goals, five games for the first team. Away he goes, Aspas, clear on a goal. Has his confidence returned? It has with a finish like that. Something we never saw when he was in the colours of Liverpool. But he does it so instinctively in the colours of Celta de Vigo. And Barca were behind against Atletico Madrid just for a couple of minutes and they replied quickly. Tonight they haven't. Celta are now two ahead. It's poor defensive play from Gerard Pique. And again, they're punished. Untidy, casual, sloppy play from Barcelona. They're looking to try and get back on level terms as quickly as possible. But it's brilliant from Aspas. Just closing down. He's just trying to... A lost cause between the pair of them. Aspas breaks away. He knows he's being chased down by the two central defenders. He knows that Ter Stegen is coming out. Ter Stegen adjusts his position. But it's a brilliant dink. Great skill for me, Argo Aspas. And it's a devastating burst of exciting attacking ability from Celta Vigo. That's given them the two goal lead. They've been absolutely fantastic. Flick of the main post by Nacho. Sergio boxes the ball away. Barcelona of committed players. What a brilliant touch by Diego Aspas. What is going through his mind here? One on one, he can finish it. He can. Yes, Liverpool fans, it's the same guy. Iago Aspas scores his second goal against Barcelona. Barcelona trail in Vigo by three goals. It's unforgivable defending from Barcelona. And from a set piece, they're allowed to clear itself to Vigo, and then it's so easy for Iago Aspas. When I say easy, the run from the halfway line is unopposed. The hard part is sticking the ball past the goalkeeper. Just as I was saying, the Barcelona had three good attempts the first ten minutes of the second half. That just might knock the stuffing out of Luis Enrique's team. The comeback might be beyond them. Celta Vigo made the most of every chance that's come their way. It's too easily cleared on the edge of the box. Sergio Roberto has to do more to keep it in the danger area. Stop this. Danny Elvis doesn't do enough on the halfway line. When Aspas is away, they're not going to stop him. Can he finish it off? Of course he can. Well, it's the same combination. Aspas, the scorer, and the assist once more is from Molito. Messi. Brilliant ball by Messi. Can they get a goal? They can. They have ten minutes to find two more Barcelona. For the first time this evening, they make the most of a gap, and Neymar has given them a lifeline. Can you believe we're saying that? Barcelona have a lifeline in Vigo. In fairness to Barcelona, there is plenty of time left. It's a good run from Neymar, a pass from Messi. Great first touch from Neymar and an excellent finish. They've had their chances, they've finally taken one, they've got ten minutes left. In Vigo, they play for the fourth goal. It's Maya with options. It's Gudetti. It's four goals to Celta de Vigo.
John Gadetti, the former Manchester City youngster, has added to the humiliation of Barcelona. Barcelona got one back, Munir should have got the second, and again, it just turns around so quickly. Another chance for Celta, and another one that they take. And this time it's Guidetti, the substitute, hasn't been on the pitch long, and has made an impact. And they can rest assured there's no coming back for Barcelona now. Not even Barcelona, in these circumstances, against the rampant Celta Vigo. Hugo Meyer with the right back, still pushing forward, and search for that fourth goal, and they know that wraps the game up. Good play from the right back to pick out a teammate, and a smart finish from Guidetti. It's been a brilliant game so far. Still time left for another one or two goals. I have no idea, idea which way they're going to go, though. But the point.